Hi everyone, it's Dawn and I hope you're having a fantastic day. Well, Carnival, just the other day, closed all cruises through the month of July, at least for sale. And guess what? <laughs> they just went further than that. So many people just noticed that the Carnival Cruise Line, you could not book any cruises all of a sudden for the month of July. They were blocked off. Now there were three sailings that you still could book. That was on the Carnival Vista and Breeze out of Galveston. And then you had the Horizon out of Miami that you could still book for. And people were speculating that those are the three cruise ships that the cruise lines are gonna try and have ready and get opening and the other sailings will maybe get canceled. Well, three days after doing that, they now all so suspended all the cruises in August as well. You cannot buy tickets right now for August, neither. So July and August are, are gone. So June, July, August, there's your summer, folks, uh, for those ships which now have people speculating, are they gonna cancel those cruises? Are they just stopping them because they are they don't know about the capacity limits? What's the deal? And Carnival has come out and said that they have stopped those sell selling those cruises while they evaluate the CDC's new framework that was issued on May 5th. And they're trying to work through things. Don't forget this week, we also have the court case going on uh, where the state of Florida, Alaska, and Texas are now suing the CDC and the federal government. There, there may be some situations coming from that. There's all kinds of things. So Carnival's sitting and waiting to find out. They want to find out what Florida's conversation is going to be about vaccine passports because if you remember carnival is one of those few cruise lines have said nothing about vaccinations yet they have said nothing about almost everything so far they've kept pretty quiet during this whole situation that uh they're, they're letting the other cruise lines and clia kind of speak for them so we have royal caribbean who's very optimistic that they can get things going but in the same frame of mind they've set up cruises out of other ports in the Caribbean that they're not going to worry about Florida right now. Royal Caribbean, uh, sorry Norwegian has come out right out and flat and said they may have to leave Florida for other states because of the the new law instituted about vaccines and now Carnival has suspended July and August cruise sellings. Now here's the thing in those frameworks for guidance about setting sail and there really was no limits on passengers. They just said restricted pa guests, restricted passengers. They didn't come up with exact numbers yet. They say for test cruises, how many people are allowed, but I couldn't find actual restrictions on the amount of people allowed on the cruise ships to begin sailing. So that might be more guidance that they're still waiting for from the CDC to come forward. Who knows? There's so many things that are still unanswered. We thought when we finally got some guidance and here's some set rules that things would be clearer. But the way that the CDC has come out with their new guidelines, it's now because they're saying 95% of passengers, 98% you don't have to do this. And if you don't do that, you have to do all these things. And the cruise lines are going... Uh, which like, and then the governor saying you can't ask for the vaccine. So whose law reigns, whose does what? It's more confusing now than it ever was about the restart of cruising. And uh, it, it's not seeming to get any clearer whatsoever. But again, Carnival now suspending at least the selling of cruises all the way to September, which now leaves the fall season all by itself. Let me know what you guys think. Do you think they're going to cancel those cruises? Do you think they're just, they don't know about the limits? What are the restrictions? They don't even know if they're still going to be at a sale or not. Because remember, they have to bring in, you know, ask for permission to bring their ship in 28 days in advance. They have to have, make sure a certain amount, it's just, 
It's a whole framework for sailing, everybody. Well, I hope you appreciate this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. Want to see more tips, more tricks, more travel blogs from around the world? Hit that subscribe button. Until next time, have yourself a safe and a great vacation.